You don't really know much about Halloween. Hello and welcome to another Sinister Snacks. I'm your host, Laura. I'm Joel. And we're the New Duds. And we're coming at you with another snack today. And we've got a lot of dog action going on today. Um, but today we've got, oh, what, where do you got this on? All right. Sandwich what is it? chips. It's your favorite brand. Hairs. Hairs. Sandwich chips. Sweet onion flavored extra bold potato chips. <gasps> They're for topping your favorite sandwiches. All the that things is on like there. one of my favorite things to do. All of the things on there make me happy. I absolutely love putting chips on sandwiches. It oh. is like my favorite freaking thing to do ever. Only if it was kettle, it would be perfect. Yes. All right. Let me see. I'm gonna I'm gonna open this bag of chips here. Give me one second. All right. Sandwich chips. Brought to you by Hairs. It's very oniony. It smells really good. You want to sniff? You want to take a sniff? Ooh. Yeah. I wanted to read it here real quick on the back. Yeah. So finally, the perfect potato chips to add to sandwiches. These heavily seasoned chips have the bold flavor of your favorite condiments along with the big crunch of potato chips. <sighs> This combo adds a satisfying experience to any meal. Add hairs. Say it. Hairs. <laughs> Sandwich chips to your next meal to take it to a whole new level. Oh, that's from Ed. Hair? Yeah, hair. Hair. Uh, chairman and CEO. For more delicious ways to use hairs produ products in your favorite foods, you can scan the code. There's QR codes on everything nowadays. We're fans. Yeah. Um, of a of, QR code? Of hairs. Oh. Yeah, it, doesn't it smell oniony? It did smell oniony. Yeah. Uh, on, oniony. Um, and uh, I'm. You're excited. I know you like sweet onion. Cheers mm. before you chew. What she said. Now, when I see extra bold, I expect it to be punchy in the face. Well, I'm going to tell you right off the bat, that is oniony. That is very oniony. Like, you don't want to be getting ready to go out on a date. You're like, I better have a bag of Hare's chips before we go so I'm not, my tummy's not growling while I'm sitting at the dinner table waiting for my hors d'oeuvres. Don't eat these. But if you're putting these on a sandwich, you want them to be extra, extra. Ooh. They're not joking. That is some bold chips. You know how Lay's, you know, we pick on Lay's a lot here at, at Sinister Snacks um, Incorporated. Anyway, they put like so much salt on there, it burns your tongue like a Cap'n Crunch. These have enough seasoning on them that uh, it's not burning my tongue, but it's that same kind of situation where you're like, is this too much seasoning? No. My wife says no. You're putting it on a sandwich, first of all, because that's what they're for. So if you want to eat them because you like bold onion flavor, like I do, I would eat them by themselves um, because I like onion. I do too. I eat raw onion all the time. She does. Yeah. Um, I mean, I eat it on sandwiches. Yeah. I eat it on, on and in things, um, salads, all sorts of stuff. Cars. Um, huh? In cars. In cars? Maybe eat them in cars. No. Um, food but, in cars. Um, yeah, if you're going to put this, like like what it, the instructions say, it's going to dilute the boldness because you're, you've are you got either meat or cheese or some sort of other condiment that's going to wash uh, or dilute, I feel like, the seasoning stuff away a little bit. 
bread, mayonnaise, bread, mustard. Yeah. Whatever. So um, keep that in mind. Um, that's why it's so bold. Yeah, I don't know that I would eat them on their own. I would. And I'm not a sandwich eating chip guy. I am. Uh, so this is more aimed at, at my wife than yeah. myself. So if you're like me and you like onion flavors and stuff, you like onion flavor though. I do, but I'm not getting sweet onion as much as mm. I'm just getting onion, mm. which is fine because I I'm like getting onion. getting like funion but, kind of. But like ratcheted it up. Like I'd have to try it on a sandwich to see whether I'd go with it that route. Try it on your um, next sandwich, Joel. But by itself, probably not going to be the first chip I grab. But if I like it on a sandwich, uh, but I can't fault them. They the advertising is one hundred percent accurate. What yep. they say they've got there, you're getting what you was promised. Yep. So, so on a scale of one to ten or zero to ten, I guess. <laughs> um, big fat zero. No. Um, I, six. I'm gonna say nine. Because they're not as crunchy as I usually like. Because I like a real like tough chip. But I'm going to say nine because it's super oniony. It, it is exactly what they're advertising. If only it was kettle, it would be. It would have been a ten. Chef's kiss for, for this one. Mm -hmm. But uh, and, yeah. And you know, I like spicy also. He does like spicy. Yeah. All right. So until next time. Go to our website. At oh, yeah. newlydeads.com <laughs> for Thanks, all Julie. of your yes. uh, newlywed, newly, newly, newly dead needs. Mm, oh, I said weds. You said there. newlyweds. Because we newly dead needs. All of our things are on there. We um, have a podcast, we have a TV show. There's new content six days a week. For us. We, yes, we like uh, creating art, all sorts of fun things. Um, we're also going to be at the uh, the market, <laughs> the summer ween market here uh, at Wolf Hollow at the end of May. So I'm sure that this will air before then. It should, in ideally. In 2024. So if this is in the future, many years from now, because this is still probably going to be on our YouTube channel. Many years from now. I don't know why I sang it. Because <laughs> that's then, what you do. That's already happened in, in the future. It's in the past. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but anyways. Uh, yeah. So thank you very much for watching. And until next time. Let's quit yakking and get back to snacking. Halloween, the festival of Samhain.